Hello guys again, my name is Andrew of course and today we've got another unboxing, reviewing and testing and yes I'm so excited because in front of me I have the new Smart Session set. This is a multi-device that it can control. Well, if you're a fan of uh, Xiaomi, Xiaomi, sorry, you can control everything to your home. You can make your home so smart that maybe an alien it will gel at your home. Well, let's see what we have inside. Ooh, nice packets. Slide. Do, 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 do. Oh, yeah, nice. And another box. Oh, it feels so premium. Up and down. And voila! This is the new Mew Smart Sensor set. You can see, wow, nice packets, everything is tight inside, not going anywhere, that's nice. Well, into the box, we can see some logo of the Xiaomi, and he says, Mew Smart Sensor Set, model ZHTZ02LM. Inside included to the box, we can see, one MIUI control hub, MIUI control sensor 2, Windows door sensor, wireless switch, here it is. Well, let's take them out one by one, don't come on out, don't be shy, nice device, this is the main unit, this is the brain of your system, it will do everything this unit. We can see we have one button. You can see this is RGB or only white. We are going to find out together, of course. Next, we've got the motion sensors. Nice motion sensors, small. I like, I like it very much. Door sensor, two of that. Oh, you can see it's a magnet. small nice we have some pre-installed sticker it's nice and here and then we've got the wireless switch with the pre-installed sticker this is a button it's nice what else we've got into the box Oh, lovely, we'll get some manuals. Stay with me and you don't even have to open that. Ooh, we have some extraction tool. <laughs> you can use it to reset your devices. Then we've got some stickers. We can use those stickers for our motion detector. Okay, we have manual of course. That's nice, is English. Well, if you want to read it, it's your choice again, guys. Now, let's see if this motion detection has any battery included inside. Okay, uh, voila, just turn it and it will open. And yeah, we've got this uh, huge Panasonic. Wow, it's a huge battery of a thickness. You can see this is the CR2450 battery. It's ready to go. And there we are. Now let's see if that door sensor got any batteries included inside. Well, if it's hard to open, you can use this extraction is for smartphones. If you want to open any smartphone, just pop up the gaps. Ah, nice. Uh, we're going to find out if there is any battery included inside. Yep, we've got a battery included inside. This is the CR1632. And now we can close it again. Oh, that's nice. We need to 
connect it to the power, install the app, the Xiaomi Home, just install it, Xiaomi, and we need to pair a device. We've got power switch, lighting, household security. BU control hub. Of course, we need to install. And there it is. We can see the light. BU control hub. Operation confirmed. Please press and hold the button on the hub for more than 5 seconds until the lights blinks in. Waiting to connect. Please open the app. Yeah. We have some instructions. You can hear. It's blinking. And let's push next. Scanning for this device. It can find my wireless. We need to insert again a password. Okay. I have a, agreed to the user agreement privacy policies and next bring phone closer to device. It is my phone closer to Connecting. Device. Connecting. Please wait. Please wait. I'm so glad that I'm here in the language English and not some Chinese version. Wi-Fi connected successfully. Thank you, lady. Well, we are waiting, make sure that we find it well, device added, done, one, two, yep. Connected successfully. Now, recommended room, okay, skip that. Device name, I'm going to leave it the same. Next, share device with, let's get started. Well, cancel and, oh, we've got a firmware update is available. Let's do that. Update. Updating. Don't turn off or use your device before finishing. It's flashing as you can see. Mm -hmm. Have some lighting. Again, we have a blue light. Well, after we have finished the firmware update, we can open the Xiaomi Home. We can go to the Mio Control Hub. You can see we have some options. Night light. It can open the light and off the alert. That triggers the alarm and disable more options. We are going in another interface if we are push this alert enable again enable the alert and disable again down to the messages we can see we have the new windows door center you can rename it of course um, you can see when you have opened and closed the doors or the new motion center you can see when it have sense any movement what time the same and the click is the wireless uh, switch that we have uh, here you can push it once or it depends what kind of settings you have uploaded to this uh, uh, wireless switch well let's move now to the auto auto we have the alert time it alert you can manage when you can but period you want to start your alert or turn off your alert a timer same here then we have the alert trigger devices here you can um, enable or disable what uh, kind of devices they are going to trigger your alarm you can see i have the room and the living room uh, motion detector uh, disabled well once one problem that is very frustrating for me is there is no any dedicated button that you can push it and the it can trigger the uh, it can uh, enable the alarm but disable the motion detections where when you are indoors that means you need to stay indoors to your place and not 
to have enabled your uh, motion uh, uh, detectors. There is no dedicated button that it can do that. Well, I will uh, go to the uh, sense, then there you can uh, do some, let me show you at sense, here you can do some, th some things, uh, if you push add, if, if we are assuming, um, you have opened the door that is the bedroom of the Mi window and door sensor, door opens, then what it will do? Add, Mi control hub, it will enable your alert mode, it disable alert mode, turn on hub light, turn off hub light, play, a designating green doors that you want, all that you can choose it, but making a new scene. Well, I don't need that right now. Okay, let's go to the delay effective time. Here we have take effect now when you're pushing to um, enable your alarm. More settings, we have the hub alert ringtone. You can choose what ringtone you want. Alert volume from zero to 100%. Alert red light blink time, always blinking. We have the alarm time continuously. Push notification is required, you cannot do anything. Link in linkage alert, that means you can uh, link another unit that you can use it just for uh, alert, just like uh, only for alarm. Well, timer color it lamp. Uh, here you need to install some uh, Xiaomi LED lamp, yay light. I will do that. Snooze alarm clock. Here we got repeat Monday to Friday, select alarm ringtone, alarm clock tone volume, etc. etc. Now let's say we need to make an add scene, add push this button, add well me wireless single press, and then what it will do, add you it will uh, enable the alarm. That's nice. Save it and on alarm okay then again another one because we want to turn off the alarm double press by turning off the alarm and what it will do disable the alert and then save alarm off nice and then we're going to try it of course and then turns off the alarm. And you can see in that here on a hub, more options. Icon is changing, double press, alert is disabled. Of course, we've got a notification. With, we have a notification, whatever you're doing, you're going to get a notification. Now, it's nice, more options, auto again, doorbell. If you want, you can use a doorbell. You can buy um, another accessories and you can add it and you can use a doorbell. Or you can use a doorbell with this button. You can make it to just uh, work only with a doorbell. Here we have a uh, doorbell trigger devices, uh, well, you can, uh, with a Mi wireless switch, here it is, you can choose that, and voila, we are good to go. Doorbell tones, of course, cracking sound, hmm, funny tone, alarm clock, nice. You have a doorbell volume, message, uh, mobile messages reminder, and devices. To the devices, of course, you can choose uh, Miu Control Hub, what kind of color you want to get. Here it is, the color it lamb uh, brightness. Everything that, that's nice. Scene color of uh, colored it lamp. 
romantic pink and that's nice you have varieties that you can choose volume settings doorbell volume prompt volume alert volume language of avoid prompt volume nice a child device okay and again to the hub and here we got the general settings firmware update you want to make a firmware update more settings security settings on turn on password to guide password to view device network from report an issue legal info nice okay on auto out on alert guard i have already so you alert trigger devices it will trigger the alarm, the living room and the two sensors, the motion sensors that I've got in the living room and to the rooms. I only enable those when I'm leaving from the house or I'm going for a vacation, traveling, whatever. For a long time, I enable this. If I enable this and I will trigger the alarm into my home here, unfortunately, Unfortunately, the, when I'm moving to my house, they will sense my motion and they will trigger the alert. There is no settings in the device, in the, the app, to have a dedicated button that is only enable the door sensors. This is a thumbs down Xiaomi, definitely is a thumbs down for me. I don't know if everyone else has this problem or have a solution to this problem or I forgetting something i didn't understand something to the app please uh, illuminate me down below to the comments and say how to do <laughs> okay well for me now it's only goes from here uh, alert uh, uh, try uh, trigger devices to enable or not the motion uh, sensor well now i'm going to try we have the here uh, I, I will show you we've got all the logs what time the door opens uh, what i'm close etc etc we have a replace icon we can uh, replace your icon from your its uh, sensor or motion detection um, the automation we have some automation that you cannot add scene what you can do about that is the same thing that i show you before then we can go to the general settings, device names, what device, what name you want to give, report an issue, time zone at home screen circuit. And here it is. Well, I think it's a nice app, it's a nice alarm. Definitely, it will do a lot of things. If you've got all of Xiaomi devices, uh, there is a variety of Xiaomi devices. I'm sure you're going to find out and not and work with this app. Of course, if you're going to push here, you can see how many devices of Xiaomi there is. There are 10 of hundreds. Well, now I'm going to add my LED lamp, smart lamp to work all these three lamps that I've got with the alarm. And there it is, you can see in a closer look how they are. Well guys, I think uh, this device is very uh, helpful definitely it will do the job that it meant to be um, in my next video stay with me don't forget to subscribe uh, share this video and hit the notification bell because in the, my next video you're going to see how i have been set, make the setup to my home where i put it my alarm and how it's working with gay lights leds i hope it will be helpful how to use the uh, xiaomi home app uh, with this uh, new smart sensor set and how you can uh, make some uh, settings that it will help you uh, to work uh, better with this uh, uh, smart sensor. 
with all that guys this is the end of the video thank you again for watching please subscribe to my youtube channel and as i said don't forget hit the notification bell next video it will gonna be the old system how i have uh, installed it to my home thank you again have a nice and lovely day bye bye